guys and welcome to the video and I hope that you are feeling awesome. Alright guys, we are venturing out to a place that was called Valley Pit, later known as Paul's Pit. So I thought, do you know what, I'm just going to go out there and see what evidence I could find in the area. Alright guys, um, I just had a look at the map again it looks like they've updated their information on their database, right? Actually the place was called Valley Mine and it opened in 1890 and it closed in 1895. It was owned by the Canuck and Rugely Colliery Company. If you see where that circular thing is, that's where they're saying this mine shaft should have been, right? If you look where the X is, that's where we're currently stood right now. However, if you look at this map, there is no evidence of this shaft or mine area or anything being there. So it looks like we've got headed down that direction there, which means we've got to go down this huge, pretty much hill going straight down there. Get off me. Stuck. You really have to be going careful, guys, when you go in things like this, especially with these thorns and such Ooh. but yeah we made progress we started up there we've worked all the way down here and now we're heading still in that direction there I would say that we are pretty much you know two-thirds of the way down into this section here and I believe that that section just in front of us there was where the mine was because if you look at the house this particular house here that has got the square around it right and you go to where we are at the X and where the um, zero um, the circle is sorry is where that mine should be so now if you look at this view here we are here we are X right You've got the mine there, and then you've got the house just over there, which is the house I was talking about. And already it looks all very hilly. I can't see anything here resembling, you know, any bricks. I can't see any bricks at all, actually, in this area here. So let's have a see if we can see anything further on over this area here. Oh, okay. Interesting. What's this? Ah, you pranked me. I thought you were... Actually... You are a brick. Crikey, that's a strange looking brick, guys. Is, there, is, that, a, is that a brick? Or is it wood? Nope, that is definitely brick there. And there. Actually, to be truthfully honest, guys, I don't know if you can see it, but this has got lots of bits of bricks and stuff inside this. It almost makes me feel that this here, I'm on the right area, but you never know, especially, you know, thinking about it, it shut in like 18, <coughs> sorry, it shut in 1895, so how many years nature can take over a certain area, but let's have a look, look around this area. Looks like we've got some bricks in that section there, hopefully you should be able to see that, there you go, that, that there is a, that's a brick. Let's have a little look what's up here. It's a bit strange that there, but anyway, let's have a look around over here. Oh. Bits of broken bricks by the looks of things. All that there. Just find another, another brick there, just in that little space there. Actually, if you look at this, it's 
some sort of that's not a brick, that's some sort of a, a slab. Just right out of that. You got another bit there. So it looks like what they've done in this area, they must have broken up all the, any buildings and such like that in this location and scattered it around. Whoa, what's over here? It's like no freaking way guys. This is what I love about coming out on adventures. You see all sorts. Seriously, hopefully if I can get it over here safely. Just look at that tree there. Oh. <coughs> look at that. How the roots are showing like that. That is absolutely awesome. Okay guys, after further inspections, after getting home from doing this adventure, I realized that this area was actually where the shaft location was. All right guys, let's have a look at this area here. That was just tree stuff, right. Oh God. Other than crazy looking trees as per usual. Can't really see anything over this direction. What's that? It's a bit of land that drops down over here. Maybe that might have been, wait a second. Let me have a little look see like this. Whoa, this is like a real big hole down here. And we've got a huge, oh, steep in, like goes down there. And if you just look over here, I zoom in there, that is broken bricks right there. And all up there, and up there, and up there. Guys, just look at this. This tree roots, right, is got bricks and all sorts of slabs. I don't know what this stuff here is, right, but it's got all of it inside all this. Absolutely proof that Mother Nature wins. Okay guys, let's see what we can find over this area. Right, I can, oh, I found a tire if anyone wants a tire. <laughs> All right, let's see what we can get over here. Because we just looked in this little area here and we've gone over there and we've, what the hell? I'm not too sure what that is. That's a I'm not too sure, but anyway, um, we're making our way down this section over here because this is the area that we haven't quite looked at yet. Oh, cri whoa, crikey, look at that. How deep that area there goes down. Look at that, just there, if I zoom in just on that section there, that there is broken, looks like broken bricks or slabs, as I said earlier. What is this black stuff here? And it goes down there. Now, do I attempt to go down here just to see what this black stuff is? I think that must be coal or some coal deposit stuff there. I am not too sure 100% here, but if you do know what this black stuff is there, if I zoom in there, if you know what that black stuff there is, please let me know in the comments below. Okay guys, I'm curious to see if there's anything over in this direction. So I thought, considering we've literally looked in this area here, we've had a good look over there, so I thought, let's see if we could find any bricks or slabs or anything over here. This is absolutely crazy. I don't know what this is, but this is, all this looks like broken bricks in all sorts in this area. Absolutely fantastic. And just look at there, more broken bricks. All this area, we've got broken bricks all up here, all over there. I have no idea what this is. It's like a mangle of different materials just been smudged into, you know, one. Oh! Oh my god! I get, wow! Guys, look at this! There's a brick that's wedged in there. On There's a tree root there with a brick. It's like, there's no... I can't even get that out of there. That is impressive. Right, let's see what we got over this area here. Oh, over and over. Uh, oh, I'm getting tangled. Nothing interesting here. No. I still like how the tree uh, roots can come out like that. It's awesome. But yeah, there we go.
Well, guys, I'm quite pleased with that we managed to see some broken bricks in all sorts and very complex on how things can grow around, you know, things that have uh, obviously been left there many years ago. But unfortunately, this is where I'm going to have to love and leave you for this adventure. So again, I'd like to say thank you ever so much for coming by and I'd love to see you on the next video. All right, bye-bye.